2023 Mitsubishi Outlander Fev First Look, Return of the Plug-in. The new plug-in hybrid SUV plays it safe with a similar formula to its conventional cousin. Mitsubishi released some additional details on the 2023 Mitsubishi Outlander FEV's powertrain, although there's much left to the imagination. Mitsubishi promises that both the front and rear electric motors make 40% more power. If accurate, that puts the front motor at 112 horsepower and the rear motor at 132 horsepower, but the total system output isn't clear. Battery capacity has also increased, from 13.8 kWh in the old FEV to 20 kWh in the new one. On the WLTP cycle, the range improves from 28 miles to 54 miles, that's a whopping 93% increase in EV-only range. On the EPA cycle, the old FEV got 24 miles, so doing the math we can guesstimate that the 2023 FEV could achieve an EV-only range of 46 miles. The 2023 Outlander FEV's gas tank capacity is also increased, which improves total range, although neither figure is given. And a new pedal mode means true one-pedal driving is possible. Seven drive modes are available, which provide the expected slippery condition modes, and both an eco and power mode. We hope for full details and specs, particularly US market ones, in the near future. There's no denying the aging Mitsubishi Outlander was due for a refresh, and the 2022 model certainly is that. The older Outlander, in both plug-in and conventional guises, suffered from an ancient and low-rent interior. The 2022 Outlander fixes that, moving on to the Nissan Rouge's platform and adopting very modern interior and exterior styling, not that it isn't without issues, like a third-row seat that makes it unique from its rogue sibling, but is comically cramped. But there are few plug-in hybrid electric vehicles, FEVs, in the consumer-grade compact SUV segment, and that's always been one of the Outlander FEVs' strong suits. With its revised styling, new interior, and standard third-row seat, the 2023 Outlander FEV certainly has a lot to offer compared to the previous generation. What it won't have is significant visual differentiation from the gas-only Outlander, retaining the same basic bold stride design language and the dynamic shield front end. FEV badging and a black roof, at least on some of the versions shown, seem, at the moment, to be the main difference. Perhaps more unique details will be detailed when Mitsubishi drops more information about the North American version of the Outlander FEV. We don't know anything about the powertrain as of yet, but we'd bet on a modest improvement over the 2022 Outlander FEV, which manages a peak of 221 horsepower and 24 miles of electric-only driving range. It should continue to be more powerful than the gas version. The 2022 gas model makes a square 181 horsepower and 181 foot-pounds of torque from its Nissan sourced 2.5-liter i4. The regular Outlander is already a bit portly, so we'll be interested to put the FEV on our scales. Mitsubishi will start selling the FEV in Japan in December and in the US in mid-2022. We'll get more details later this month during the full reveal of the FEV model. A sure sign that the plug-in hybrid era is maturing is the ongoing debut of second-generation electrified models, featuring powertrain improvements, better efficiencies, and longer ranges. 
and when the top-selling FEV in Canada the past three years undergoes this type of transformation, and more, it's a big deal. The all-new Mitsubishi Outlander FEV was revealed today in Japan, and while the technical specs and trim levels reflect that home market, most of what was divulged also pertains to the units bound for Canada later next year as a 2023 model. We'll start with the powertrain, which sees an increase in output thanks to a more powerful and efficient 2.4-liter .4 four-cylinder engine and the larger capacity battery. The new gasoline unit, while the same size as the previous models, provides 131 horsepower and 143 foot-pounds of torque, an increase of 5 and 4, respectively. Likewise, the two motors, mounted front and rear, also stay the same size, but have increased their outputs to 113 horsepower and 134 horsepower, respectively. That same size more power theme continues with the upgraded lithium-ion battery pack, which offers 350 volts and 20 kilowatt hours of total capacity, compared to 300 volts and 13.8 kilowatt hours in the current model. Other battery improvements include an all-new cooling system that utilizes a so-called heat sink structure that directly cools each cell with refrigerant, and the new battery temperature adjustment system that optimizes the battery temps while charging at lower temperatures, something very relevant for those Canadian winters. First look, 2023 Mitsubishi Outlander FEV. The second-generation plug-in hybrid gets a bigger battery, more power, and longer range a sure sign that the plug-in hybrid era is maturing is the ongoing debut of second-generation electrified models, featuring powertrain improvements, better efficiencies, and longer ranges. And when the top-selling FEV in Canada the past three years undergoes this type of transformation, and more, it's a big deal. The all-new Mitsubishi Outlander FEV was revealed today in Japan, and while the technical specs and trim levels reflect that home market, most of what was divulged also pertains to the units bound for Canada later next year as a 2023 model. We'll start with the powertrain which sees an increase in output thanks to a more powerful and efficient 2.4-liter .4 four-cylinder engine and a larger capacity battery. 